Yo, welcome to the video. It's DK the Saint, and today we're watching Lil Sky's career is officially over. Yo, I won't even lie. I can't remember the last time I listened to a fucking Lil Sky song. Like, no disrespect. Like, I won't lie. I want to. If he drops new songs, I'm not gonna lie. I might have to react to that shit one time still. Cause I feel like I haven't listened to the nigga songs in like fucking four years. All right, let's get into it. Let's get into it. So, Lil Skies dropped the project the other day, oh, and I see literally no one talking about it because if we're being completely honest here, Lil Skies is nowhere near as popular as he was That's during his peak back in like 2018, okay. 2017. You, you but can regardless say, you can of say, that- Yo, like, respectfully, you can you can say he officially kind of fell off, but like, I don't know if he has more- like, uh, He still does have still. a fan base oh. that cares about okay. him oh, and his he? music. Oh, and you know, he's always going to fuck? have his supporters, um, but as a pretty big fan of Lil Sky's music, this project pretty much killed nah, any last chance that he had of making any sort of comeback because this project, it isn't good. Now oh. imagine that you're a pretty big fan of Lil Sky's. His last project was over then, three fam. years ago, <laughs> back in the beginning of 2021. And on top of that, it also wasn't very well received when it first came out. So you have fans who have been waiting for- I don't. I'm trying to remember that if I if I if I heard that song, like I don't think I did. Like I don't know. For three I whole years, that. for Lil Skies to come back and drop a really solid project, and that's all he has to do to be back in the mainstream. And after going and listening to this new project, Out mm -hmm. Your Body Music, I can Dang confidently on, say, as a Lil Skies fan, that this shit is horrible. This is trash. Let me give my song? short review about like this like? project and why I think it's bad. First of all, the production oh. is really bad. All the beats sound bland and uninteresting. Oh. And even the mixing on this okay. project is kind of iffy in my opinion. And I think the main reason for this is because recently Los Guys has been working with this new producer. His name's Zerby, and I'm not gonna lie, no disrespect to the man, but he's really not that good. Damn. And I'm not the only person that thinks this. If you oh, go damn. on Los Guys' Instagram and you scroll down on his comments, you'll have oh, quite a, a lot nigga, of people bro. commenting, yo, this Zerby guy ain't it, bro. You gotta lock in yeah, nigga, with a new nigga, producer nigga, because nigga, this nigga, recent nigga, shit nigga, has nigga, been nigga, kinda nigga, whack. Nigga, but aside from the production, another nigga, thing about YouTube this project right, that man, I just really didn't like is the actual performance because almost every single song on this project it feels like a practice yapping, song it feels man. like they just went in there decided to warm up with the vocals and everything song, but no oh, these man, are actual even... songs that oh. were recorded and they were intended oh. to actually be put out that's crazy to me i also heard somewhere that los guys doesn't write anymore he just freestyles all his music now and judging by the past couple releases yeah i can really tell and <laughs> it's not crazy. just the lyrics across this project that really throw me off it's the I drop freestyles too, nigga. All my songs are freestyles. The actual flow and energy <laughs> yeah, and the delivery of the lines that just sound really bad here. Now, I'm pretty sure that the reason for the lack of energy across all the songs is because over the past couple of years, if you've been paying attention, then you'll notice that Lil Skies has been sipping a lot of fucking lean. He's also okay, been rapping bro. about it way more than he don't blame the lean because there's niggas out here sipping that cup, dropping bangers. Don't do that. It's never the lean. You know what I'm saying? He ever did before. He even has okay, a whole just song joking. on this Don't project called Drank Talk, which is literally just about lean. sipping lean. lean. And I mean, it's his ridiculous. choice ridiculous. at the end of the day to do all that. I am a little bit concerned, partly because it's affecting his music and the quality of it, but also because lean songs. is so lie. fucking bad for you. Songs. Like, that is literal liquid lean heroin. Drops. It's a highly oh, addictive thing that can literally change the way your brain functions permanently. Mm -hmm. It's an opioid. I'm pretty sure everyone watching knows that lean is quite the fucking bad drug to take. So yeah, Back on topic, nice. the lyrics are really bad. The flow and delivery also not so good. The production is mediocre. Is All the beats Bro, sound bland. The flow and delivery ass. also not so oh good. The production is mediocre. All the beats trash, sound bro. bland and uninteresting. I will say that Thousands and Misunderstood are two of the best songs on here. Everything else is either all right or just straight up trash. Call Me, it's just all right. It's nothing too crazy. It's your government mandated Lil Skies song. Nothing to speak about there. Drank Talk is also actually actually pretty decent besides thousands and misunderstood i would say that it's like the third best song on here you have okay. thousands which is a decent song and then you have death oh <laughs> brother this guy stinks this was released as a single what? before the project no. dropped and i just genuinely don't understand why skies put this out oh, it's just crazy. not good it sounds like a really horrible attempt at making a rage song except oh. the lyrics are so basic to the point where it's i had to stop a little boot. Go ahead and shoots. 
Okay. Actually laughable. I would have said that this is the worst that song on the like entire a, like a, like a 2017 type track. Was that too old? It, but then old. I heard Pivot, and that no, one's somehow was... even worse. Skies throughout the song, for some reason, is trying to do this oh, no. deep voice like for an entire me. verse, and it's just oh. so bad. Yeah, just just listen York, to the uh... beginning of Yo, this song. Air... Okay, he killed him, but it's look just so air bad. Just, air just air listen air to air the okay, beginning hey, of this like, song. Damn, <laughs> What is bro doing? Why are you just moaning on the mic? I don't know who it is on Sky's team that gassed him up enough to put this not only on the tape, but have an entire video dedicated just to that That's song. Cute. But they did my boy dirty with that one. That song should have never left the vault. Then we have my personal favorite the song fuck? on the project, Misunderstood. The yeah, I like this one actually. The flow's really good, it's easy to vibe to. To okay. me, it's honestly a better version of the song Wake Up. The only bad yeah, part of this song for me is the part where he goes like and that's why i've been running 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 that shit is whack but everything else this about the song is pretty savage. solid then we have you're the not song him buddy out of time no, which in my yeah, opinion kind of sounds like a throwaway from unbothered fault, there's really nothing special about this song the lyrics sound the same flows pretty generic yeah not really too big of a fan of this one and then we have the final song to close out the whole thing change on me i really don't like this fucking song the whole chorus with him going like why did they change on me? It's just cringe. And by the time you get through that chorus, the actual verse itself okay. is filled with some of the most surface level lyrics with shit like, going through a lot and everybody acts surprised. Why are you looking at me like I'm really not I that mean, guy? It's a Been putting style, that work so. for so damn long, I might just cry. Yeah, this one's a miss. If I had to rate this out of 10, I'd probably give it like maybe a three, a three damn, and a half. I just feel like Skies could do so much better and actually deliver Deliver with a good project, and this is despite a what a lot of people are saying. Nigga. If he really decided to walk Damn. in and work with new producers, get off the lean, and, and actually genuinely try. Okay, let's be real, my nigga. You gave the man a 3 out of 10, and you're saying it's just the producer? What the fuck are you talking about? There's no way he's getting a 3 out of 10, and it's just the fucking producer. That nigga's just trash. You're a fan of that nigga, you're saying he's a three man, his nigga's yeah. I with his music, he could he could have a good amount of success. With it. But for now, shit about? like this really does not help. But it's like Skies almost doesn't want to do that. It's like he's doing yeah, everything probably, in his power. He probably just puts out all his songs, you know? Like he doesn't like, you know, don't really care about them, he just puts them out type shit to diminish his career to the point where everyone will forget about him. Like, he'll go on IG, things. he'll preview a song, people love it, people are fucking Ooh. with it, and then he'll proceed to never Ooh, drop that ADHD, song and instead yeah. give a mid-ass yeah. song that nobody asked this for and nobody likes. And but hey, distracted. what can you do? It's his career at the end of the day. He'll put out the music that he wants, mm -hmm. even though I'm sure many people can agree that the quality is certainly not there anymore. I just hope that Life of a Dark Rose 2 is gonna be good. I really hope he puts on songs like Gone in the Wind, Candy Rain, Bad guys inhale my smoke. Montclair coat, never sober. There's a lot of good leaks that he has that he just doesn't want to put out. But yeah, what do y'all think? Let me know down in the comments below. Can Lil Skies still make a comeback after this? Or is he just completely washed? Let me know down below. And, and yeah, um, see ya. You know what, bro? I'm gonna react to one of his songs and we'll see if he's washed. See you in the next video, nigga. I know, brother.